Hello, good evening. Our action tonight comes to you from the Spanish capital and from the always atmospheric Metropolitano here in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Atletico Madrid taking on Real Madrid. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? This is the starting lineup for Atletico. Jan Oblak stands between the posts. Marcos Llorente starts alongside Koke in central midfield. And up front, Antoine Griezmann starts alongside Alexander Sornot. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Thibaut Courtois begins in goal. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Nacho Fernandez in central defence. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. And the game begins. Bellingham. Here's Mbappe. Valverde. Mbappe with it. Alert defending. Vinicius Junior. Well, slightly off target, and that'll be a throw in. Vinicius. Promising sequence. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Valverde. Nice weight on the pass. And Bellingham on to Valverde. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Well, let's get more details on the injury situation from our pitch side reporter, Jeff Shreves. Physio's up on the touchline keeping an eye on him as he went over on his ankle. It looks like he's going to be OK. Cheers, Jeff. Mbappe, and able to close down the shots. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Mbappe. And on to Bellingham. And a fine stop. Now sending it in. Oh, tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top-class save, I have to say. Corner kick played in. And still a chance. Rodrigo and he stopped them in their tracks
Axel Witzel. Koke with it. He failed to keep it that time, Saul. And playing it through. Mbappe. Four marks to the keeper. Well, what a reaction from the goalkeeper. Such a good save in the end. Well, he can't believe his side haven't taken the lead there. That was a big chance. Keen to take it short here. Oh, thwarted it there. And what a piece of defending we've just witnessed. Saul. Alexander Surlot. Lino. Atletico have given us away. What can Real do from this position? Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Theme emerging of wasted possession. The first half here comes to an end. Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. Real Madrid coming away with it. Mbappe. Koke Samuel Lino and he has options available Vinicius Junior no possibilities in the centre must take the lead here denied and they remain locked together well that's a good save but really he should have scored from there that's a big chance and here's a change now for Atletico he read the situation defensively and did his job Alexander Surlot. Now Griezmann. Composed and patient passing. Griezmann. Meat and drink to the Belgian. Well, I just wonder whether Atleti will come to regret these missed chances because their attacking play and creativity has been excellent. They deserve to be further ahead here. An Atletico throw in coming up here. Substitution for Real Madrid. Now, well, Molina. And Vixel with it. Molina. A quarter of an hour remaining here. And very nicely positioned to win it back. Koke and teammates around him and here they come now Atletico looking for a late winner
Well, they might be able to launch a counter-attack. Kylian Mbappe. Just cutting off the supply. And they remain locked together, these two sides, on the back of that save. Well, that keeps it all level. What an important save that is. And time for the change now. Playing it in, struggling to get it away. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. That is that after 90 minutes. They are level and extra time is coming up. Understandable that fatigue might set in. A strength sapping night for all concerned as the first period of extra time begins. Vinicius Junior. Mendy has it. Modric. Going well. Perhaps an opportunity here for Real Madrid to take the lead. Corner. Who can he pick out? Well, not the best clearance. Vinicius Jr. Are they going to forge ahead? Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Now counter-attacking possibilities. And it looked like open road for them, but up a dead end. The Atleti fans are certainly playing their part, but can the players respond and get this win up? the keeper more than equal to the task well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game whipped in by Griezmann oh that's a fine save half time in extra time and still they are level Underway again, the second period of extra time. Who's going to prevail here? That's the challenge that was required. Jose Lu. Beautifully weighted ball. find the net and he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it with time running out a corner to Real Madrid can someone get on the end of this could still be dangerous. Modric. Fine cross into the middle. Cleared away comprehensively. Rodrigo. Chance maybe. And a goal at last. The fans will feel it was worth the long wait.
Well, the initial save is a good one, as you can see, but unfortunately, it drops straight to an opponent. A bit unlucky, really. moving once more how important will that opening goal prove to be no more time left in the opinion of the referee that is that and Atletico Madrid much to their annoyance have dropped three points yes Derek there was very little in it for much of the game I'm sure they feel they deserve a point at least and it's obviously disappointing to concede in that manner so late on but they just have to bounce back now